I'm Alexis Scott and Buck Nation reigns supreme on this side of town after a huge victory over Vets Memorial last night. Now it's a rivalry that's been lopsided in the past, but after last night's win, it has people thinking differently. Screams from fans rang throughout Buccaneer Stadium on Thursday as Miller High School sent Vets Memorial Eagles home. We've been looking forward to beating Vets for a while now. Like This is like the most progress we made as a team together. I feel as if we've really become a unit, we became more disciplined, we really count on each other and play for each other as a team. The first half of the game was a battle as Veterans Memorial held a 24-21 lead, but when halftime hit, Bucks running back Broderick Taylor became the star of the game. I just kept the energy real high, stayed calm, and uh, tried to prepare for these moments. And it's a really good environment, so that also makes me have more, more energy. Broderick has been playing football since he was six years old. He says inspiration from his father and uncle pushed him as he scored five touchdowns for the team. Just like that, Miller scores again. We were really pumped. It was a, it was a good, good game. It hyped us up a lot. And it gave us the energy to come out hard. My my dad and my uncle played in high school, and I, I watched a few of their games, and that really that really motivated me to have more inspiration for the game. But the players are not the only ones scoring touchdowns. Head coach Justin Evans ties as the school's current coach to win the most games. These wins don't come without great kids, great community, great administration support. It truly takes a village, you know, in order to win. I'm just blessed to be the one that's you know, leading the team, but, you know, it's not about me. The foundation of football is not all about playing hard and winning games. Coach Evans says there's a greater purpose with getting on the field. I'm just so happy for our kids and the resiliency that they showed. I always tell them, if all I've ever taught you how to do is catch a football or throw a ball or how to tackle, then I failed you. But if I've taught you how to be a better man, then, then that's ultimately what it is that I want to see you uh, be successful with. Let's hope the undefeated Bucks can and keep momentum. Their next game is Friday, October 27th at 730 against Victoria West at Miller High School. Alexis Scott, Chris 6 News.